To sell them, you would see me use a power tool, but one thing I have figured out that I had before is I have a rusty old screw and I just have it locked in here to the chuck. I have an old sanding disc here then, and to remove the rust, I'm just going to go like... And you can see we've taken off the top layer of rust. Now I have some much finer sandpaper here, and I'm just going to do the same thing. And there we go, lads. Now when we screw that back into place, it'll look good as new, so... I don't like them that much. They're loud, expensive, and they break, but... They do have their uses. And a side note, I did try not to use the power tool first. Um, so you can see here, it didn't work out so well for me. So this is a rare occasion where I had to use a power tool instead. Mind you, I could have done all this by hand, but I had a whole box of them to do and I'd be here till the cows come home. So had to be done, lads. I'm sorry, okay? So they're all for part of a big old beam drill that I'll be putting together soon enough, hopefully, once I have all the parts cleaned up. But uh, you can see there just how nicely they turned out. They still have an age look to them, which I like because it's a very old piece of kit.